I start in 1980 when Pogoria was built here on the Gdańsk shipyard. It was first sailing boat, sport sailing boat built in Poland after the war and was especially interesting for, for me. It will be training vessel for the young people, for the young generation of, of people here, yeah. in, in, not, not only in Poland, but for the, how, to, how to work together mm -hmm. on the smaller ships and how to, how to set the sails and how to live in this small area for the longer time, how to cooperate one to another in the groups. And she was working quite good with this idea and she's still sailing with the young people who are, are make some really long voyages especially especially just for the money. Mm -hmm. It was time here in Poland when it was not even enough money for the for the young people, Polish young people. And she was rent to Canadian uh, program education under sales. Mm -hmm. And we are sailing with the Canadians, young people, with the Canadian school. And shortly, Canadians decide to build another bigger ships, sailing ships, for the same, the same idea. Mm -hmm. And of course, I was connected with, with these ideas, with this program. The ships was built here in Szczecin, in Poland, and. I spent quite a long time on Concordia. It was, it was the name of, of, of the, the Canadian ship. Oh, I don't remember exactly, but it was not less than 15, 16 years. It was long voyages because it was strictly connected with the school program. Mm -hmm. The one trip it was one year. Mm -hmm. Divide but Christmas time when when the ship is staying for the for the small reparation for the small service and the students were at home during the Christmas necessarily. Sometimes we were start here in Poland, sometimes in Canada, but sometimes in other places mm -hmm. uh, because usually. In this time, it was uh, trips around the world, mm -hmm. and it's happened when we are start in Canada and finish, for example, in Australia. Mm -hmm. Very, very nice shapes of the sheet, and she was looking really nice here on the waters. And with the sailing. What, 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 you know, I, 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 I never su suspect that the, the small ships can be quite safety with the heavy weather and with, with the bad weather. Andros sail quite good. I, I have some experience to, to, to sail with the motorboats from For example, from Konrad Shipsyard here in Gdańsk, mm -hmm. all the total meter are two with some hub of, of Mediterranean Sea. But the shape of Andros is a little bit different than the rest of uh, motorboats which, which are usually meeting in the Mediterranean. The Mediterranean boats, I can say, is the rather beach boats open for the sun, for the Mediterranean uh, temperatures. And Andros is, in my feeling, built for the more north water, like Baltic Sea or, or, or North Sea, or for, for American or Canadian coast, but not Canadian coast. But there's, there, there's the good words, explorer boats because she can use 
for the for the quite interesting places on, on, on the world in the north. She uh, is sailing very good with what I said with with the heavy bad weather and interior of the boat give you the, the, the place for the excellent place for the relax, for the, for the eating and for the work, for the sailing. If you like catch the fishes, of course you can. If you like snorkeling, she is excellent for it because she has open uh, open stern and you can you can locate up there all of the snorkeling equipment and the extra boats large platform yes there's the excellent working space uh, on the middle of the boat and you can keep them extra uh, equipment for the for, for your wishes but there is a lot of space and during the and anchor times or during the summer you can use the space up there. Very comfortable. Traditional and very good, very easy. There is no problem with, with the anchor equipment. You can wash the, the, the chain, wash the anchors, there you have access of the, of the water and the pumps up there. There is the, of course, electrical capstans. If you have, if you need some some stronger actions to the chains or to the lines, you can do it. No problem. The maneuvers is very easy on the anchor. She is maneuvering quite well. She has two boat thrusters then and uh, both boat thrusters. She has two, 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 two propellers, yeah. the stern boat raster, and she is very, very easy for maneuvering. Some, the worst weather was not in Biscaya, but here in the, in the La Manche, in the English Channel. Awesome. Mm -hmm. And it was quite comfortable. Mm -hmm. I have no, no, no worries about the ships, about the crew. <laughs> and it was fine. For sure, she is not jumping. Mm -hmm. She is, she is moving because of the waves. That is the quite normal situation, but very comfortable. Uh, nobody was sick on this boat during all of these trips. Even even quite new people at sea for maneuvering. It's excellent. The bunker station of the ships is, is quite professional. Mm -hmm. There is no. Or is you can sleep some some fuel around the boat. No, no, that is quite good. And we are using condition system, of course. Mm -hmm. Working quite well, no problems. Everything what you need. On the bridge you have uh, double double spaces, uh, the sitting spaces. And both of the spaces are equipped with the screens, with the radar screens, uh, with the ch uh, electronic charts. Of course, comfort is very good and equipment is quite enough. Quite enough for the bigger boats, even for the, for the ships. In, inside, you have two levels of the, of the living area. Both of them are very, very nice. One is of the level of, 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 of the galley and uh, the sit, uh, sitting rooms for at least 10 people who so are used on the, on the half of, of, of the places. And in this lower saloon, also you have plenty of living place. Of course, the, the most comfortable cab cabin there is the owner's cabin. Yeah, but the guest, guest cabin is very comfortable. Each of the cabins has have own uh, toilets and, and uh, 
showers. The, the, on, on the bow of the ship, of, of the ship, there is two place cabinets for the crew. Also, with the separate laboratory, but at least. No, well, there is the, 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 the place for, the, for, for, for the washing, for the washing equipment. Very nice. Mm -hmm. what, what, what you, uh, there is everything what you need on the, the, the longer boat. It means very good, very good engines. And there is one, one uh, generator. And generator you can start because the generator providing you with the power for the for the rest of, of equipment you can start the generator in the engine room or in for example in the um, galley. It's very easy and very comfortable. Yeah, there, is, there is a really place for, for the service up there. You can you can you, 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 you can uh, easy access to all of the equipment of the boat. If all of the owners of the owner one of, of, of Andros will be quite happy to, to sail with her. There is no problem, you can spend all the time on the boat, you can live on this boat without the problems.